we want to look at molecular total and net ionic equations. These are very time consuming uh, when you first get started, so be warned this will probably be an, a long video compared to the other ones that I've recorded. Um, you will need your solubility rules, you will need the steps to complete these. In the description you will also find um, a website that has where I've listed all of the different steps. So this time I'm being a little different, I'm giving you words that you now need to convert into compounds and then predict the products. So I've got potassium nitrate, so that's KNO3. I know that K is a plus one and NO3 is a minus one, so these two balance one another out. And then I have ammonium chloride, so I've got NH4 is a plus one, Cl is a minus one, so those balance each other out. I need to predict the product. So remember you're going to take your outsides and they're going to hook up, and you're going to take your insides and they're going to hook up. Since we said that everything is a positive one and a negative one, when we get to the other side we're not going to have to worry about any subscripts. So this will be a KCl and an NH4NO3. Now I need to find out the solubility of these. Well I know that all group 1A are soluble, so they get an AQ and an AQ. NH4 falls into that group 1A, so it gets an AQ and an AQ. Now if you remember from what we talked about before, what you've read in the book, if everything is an AQ that means there's no reaction. However, that doesn't mean you can just stop and not do anything else. So what we've just, just come up with right here, this is your molecular. So now we need to find the total. Now this is become where it becomes a little bit tricky, but we're going to work through it, we're going to be okay. If you have any subscripts that were used for balancing, those become coefficients. In our case, we didn't have any of those. So now we just need to write each individual ion that has an AQ effort, it'll become an ion, for this equation. So this will be a K plus aqueous plus NO3 negative aqueous plus NH4 plus 1 aqueous plus Cl minus aqueous. Now, you want to try and do the other side, and come back and check your answer. So how did you do? Did you get it right? As you noticed, I ran off the page, so I just kind of added it here to the bottom, and that's okay, I can understand what that means. Now, for your net, you want to go through and you're going to lightly cross out, so I still need to be able to read it if I was to grade it on an exam. Everything that looks exactly the same on both sides. Now we already indicated that everything was going to cancel. So if every single ion cancels, you need to rewrite what you had on the left hand side in the total. So that's why you don't want to mark everything out so deep that you can't read it. So we're going to get each one of those ions, because all of those are in that solution of that reaction. Now if nothing occurred, you can actually write out no reaction or just NR, whichever one makes you happier.